Yeah, hey everybody, this is Ian from Mindful Marketplace, and I'm going to give you a little bit of a, um, a lesson that I learned uh, with the card platform. This is for those of you building landing pages, uh, one page sorts of sites that you're offering to either your clients or, or you're using them for your own community with the card platform. So what I've been doing is purchasing uh, premium templates uh, from other vendors who are selling, you know, much like WordPress or uh, Ghost or any other, um, you know, kind of CMS oriented uh, platform where you have uh, themes and, uh, you know, custom templates and things like that. Always you're going to find that there are authors out there or creatives who have improved on the general aesthetic of the platform by dint of creating their own, you know, styled uh, themes and templates, right? So the same is true for a uh, card, which isn't necessarily much like Ghost or WordPress or, you know, and, or Shopify or that sort of, um, you know, software as a service. It's much simpler. It's much easier to use, but the same principle does apply. So uh, here's an example of a pro of a theme that I just purchased for a one page, um, you know, sort of course oriented landing page. We do a lot of courses. Our, our clients uh, generally sell courses uh, and you know so it just makes sense to have a lot of different variety of this sort of design on offer that we can use to sell services to our ideal audience right but one of the mistakes that I was making because I'm not that familiar with with this platform I've only been using it uh, for about a week and a half now probably intensely for only a matter of days is I was buying these templates were these themes and I was editing them my, like right away. So I was making edits to the basic theme that I was buying, um, which changes the original file, right? So I was actually modifying the file that I was purchasing without a backup copy available to me that was the original, right? So, you know, if I'm playing around or messing around or experimenting or exploring a new theme or template, without actually having the original saved, then I'm actually going, if I make a mistake or I make some edits that are not, um, you know, that are not what I want to be using on other people's projects, you're stuck because you actually find yourself having to go back to the original template and it's your modified version of that template rather than the original. So this should be pretty obvious, maybe to the many of you who are much more familiar with card than I am. You wanna make a copy, right? So the first thing you wanna do is actually duplicate the site, right? So when I do this, it's gonna make a copy of the original template. And then all you have to do Right, so here's the here was the one I purchased. Now here's the copy. And now I'm just gonna rename it and you go to manage the site. I'm not gonna do this here, but you go to manage this site and then you just change this portion here to read whatever it is that you want. Something like, um, you know, edit this one or use this for experimentation or whatever, you know, whatever you, you call it. Like here I have one that says, if you can see it, uh, on my screen, it says edit product one. And I would just change this to like edit product landing or something along those lines so that I know this is the version that I can play with rather than the version that I purchased. Now, you know, the other sort of difference between card and again, something like WordPress or uh, Ghost or any, you know, Shopify, any sort of, uh, you know, software that you might be using that's analogous um, is once someone, you have to actually get these custom themes or templates delivered to your, uh, your account, right? You're not actually downloading the themes from some external place and uploading them to your, you know, your own project area. You're actually getting them sent to you. So if I screw something up without making a copy first, 
I actually have to go back and ask the original author to resend me a copy. And that can be a little embarrassing and cumbersome and maybe even unpredictable by virtue of not knowing that someone's going to be around in six months or three months or a week. Or you don't even know, you know, someone might have designed something on a Tuesday and moved on and, you know, is unreachable on a Friday, right? So to avoid having that sort of experience, you want to just make a copy. And now I have, I can make a unlimited amount of copies of this project for unlimited amounts of clients. I'm only limited by the number of actual card licenses, for lack of the right, um, you know, kind of phraseology here, that I have installed in my back end. And in this case, I bought a hundred licenses, so I could literally make a hundred copies for a hundred different clients of this particular landing page. And if I needed more, I could buy more licenses, right? So as you can see, I have a bunch of different themes and templates back here. I have a partner who also has a, uh, a license package of a couple hundred, uh, you know, card uh, counts. So we have, you know, a, a number of these that we can do for our clients, even at the current you know, membership rate that we have, a couple hundred, 300 or more available to us already. Okie doke. And I'm going to cover much more about our, you know, evolving experience with CARD. But if you haven't yet signed up for CARD, it's really a phenomenal way of offering beautiful no-code oriented landing pages for just about anything you can imagine for your clients, your community, your members, um, you know, and it's it's super duper easy to use, and uh, I highly recommend it. All right, I've had a really good experience with it thus far. I'm recording this on the third of December, two thousand and twenty, and you know I've designed two or three landing pages for members of of our own community who are writing books, teaching courses that have taken me 20, 30 minutes that look great, that people are really happy with and makes me look a lot smarter than I am, right? So anyway, that's CARD. You can sign up for a free trial at the link below if you're interested. If you have questions about CARD, send me an email, hi at mindfulmarketplace.com, and I'll share my, um, you know, limited, um, you know, experience or expertise with the platform thus far. Okay, thank you so much for watching, and again, have a wonderful night.